Hi, this video is going to show you how to use the real time light adjustment feature in AI House. As you can see now, when you click render, there's a new option called RT light adjustment here. Let's try render now. But before that, let me show you the lights I use in this file. I'm actually using the default lighting with only one field light plate. Okay, and I also activated the sunlight effect. So, let's render the RT light adjustment now. You will see a pop-up telling you that the task has been submitted and where to find later. Just click Noted and continue. You can also click Not Remind if you do not wish to see it again. Click Return and let's wait for the render to complete. Okay, now the render has completed. You will see the picture label showing the RT light adjustment. Click on edit. When you see the pop-up, you can just click OK and you can take no longer display if you do not want to see it again. Okay, so this one is the one I edited earlier. Later, I'm going to show you the original image before editing. So with the real-time light adjustment, you can edit the lighting on the left panel in real-time and you can see the effect instantly instead of adjusting the field light board and field light like we usually did. Let's see the first one, control exposure. If you're not sure what effect it is, you can always turn it on and off to check. You can adjust the strength by dragging on the bar left to right for the exposure. When you drag the bar, you will see the effect instantly and this button is to reset the setting. Next, the exterior light here referring to the outdoor lighting on the door and window. If you turn it off, you can see that the door turned to dark. Let's turn it back on. So same thing, you can drag the bar or input the number here. Next is the self-luminous. In this file, it refers to the downlights on my ceiling. Please note that each setting is different in different files. So make use of the on and off button to check. The temperature is for you to adjust the warm or cold tone. The ambient light is the overall brightness of the file. Okay. So let's make it a bit warmer. Okay, next is the fill light spotlight. In this file it refers to the table lamp spotlight here. And then the fill light sheet light is actually referring to the fill light board you added in render. Next, the light trough, which is this one on my ceiling. And lastly, the sunlight, where you see the shadow cast on the floor over here. Okay, now I'm done with all the settings. If you wish to compare the before and after effect, you can click on this button. Hold the mouse to see the before effect and release to see the after. And if you are satisfied with it, and you wish to reuse the same effect later, you can click on Save on the right here. 
and then you can proceed to render again with different resolution. Currently the 8K is not available, so the highest is 4K. Click OK and wait for the render to complete. Let's close this and return to the render. The light effect that you save in RT light adjustment will appear under the RT light adjustment template here. So you can render the same effect again in other resolution or in panorama. So let's try with this effect in HD. So all these are the safe scene from the previous RT light adjustment. Please note that the RT light template that you save is only available to the same file you open. So let's return and wait for the render to complete. Okay, so this one is the one I submitted 4K in RT light adjustment. And the HD is the one I render using the light template saved from the RT light adjustment. This is how to use the real time light adjustment. Please give us a thumbs up if you like the video and don't forget to subscribe. Happy trying, bye!